So I want you guys to know that the whole world's looking at everything you guys are doing. I, I, I don't like being out in the public. I don't like hanging out with people. I mean, I love it, but I don't. I don't like being in the public eye. It really upsets me. This is the way I am as a person. I know that someone had to do it and nobody wants to get to go first. So I'm like, I'll go first. Like, what else are they gonna do to me? So um, it's, it's really important that you guys understand that they're recognizing everything you do. And today you're gonna hear from people in Louisiana that went to file their federal lawsuits and what, what, what they went through through their own work. Because my special guests shouldn't be titles and tiaras. They should be our friends, which is each and every one of us. If you notice, the people that I have on and I have conversations with are people that are just like us. I know a lot of you think, well, Patrick Burns not like us. He totally is. He's a good man and friends, right? Friends. And we don't all have to agree, right? But we all have the same mission, and that's freedom. And that's something that we need to keep on. There was a, a statement someone said, people are free to be stupid, but you also have the freedom to be smart, right? <laughs> so we have the right to be smart. So that's something that, um, you know, we need to remember. Now, having said that on the federal lawsuit, before we get to these amazing Americans, these fellow friends, right, that went down to Louisiana uh, to file. I wanted to tell you guys about my writ of mandamus. I got so many calls from yesterday and this morning from professors, from prestigious universities that are constitutional attorneys. And the one thing they said is, oh my gosh, like your filing has now forced a judge to see your interpretation of the constitutional amendment to the Ohio Constitution. He can't unsee that. 